Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Billionaire Lib Tom Steyer won't accept Mueller report, says Trump should be impeached for eight other crimes. Billionaire Tom Steyer's mission to oust President Donald Trump hit a roadblock after special counsel Robert Mueller's investigation failed to find evidence of collusion between the Trump campaign and Russian government. Steyer has dumped millions of dollars over the course of the past year on what many Democrats worried was an ill-fated attempt to impeach Trump. Democratic lawmakers pushed back against such plans, with House Speaker Nancy Pelosi telling reporters in January that she wants to wait for special counsel Robert Mueller to complete his investigation. Steyer responded Sunday and Monday on Twitter to Mueller's completed report. Of it real Donald Trump's ten impeachable offenses, the Mueller report only relates to two. He's still profited from his presidency, advocated violence, and more. Regardless, we must see the full report not just a four-page summary, Steyer wrote in a pinned tweet Sunday. The billionaire-turned-environmental activist has not yet provided evidence to support his contention that Trump is guilty of impeachable offenses. He reiterated his concerns on Monday. At real Donald Trump remains the most corrupt president in American history, just in terms of criminal investigations, Steyer told his Twitter followers. It was one of several tweets he posted after Mueller's report. Steyer plowed $6 million into the campaign in January, the bulk of which was slated for national cable and broadcast advertising in early presidential primary states like Iowa, Nevada, and South Carolina. Approximately $2.5 million will go to television campaigns while another $3.5 million is expected to be plowed into a digital effort, according to media reports. His donations came as Democrats regained the House after a nearly a decade in the wilderness. Some of the incoming freshman Democrats took the opportunity to jump headfirst into the impeachment push. Democratic Michigan Rep. Rashida Labe, for instance, told a crowd in January that we're gonna go in there and impeach the motherfucker. Steyer is not the only activist who is now facing the fire following Mueller's report. Democratic California Reps. Adam Schiff and Eric Swalwell repeatedly asserted as fact that Trump colluded with Russia. Democratic California Rep. Maxine Waters guaranteed in September 2017 that the president and his crew conspired with Russian President Vladimir Putin to take down former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton. Here you have a president who I can tell you and guarantee you is in collusion with the Russians to undermine our democracy. Waters said at the time. Steyer floated the possibility of gearing up for 2020 White House run and only to bail on the idea in January. Steyer played coy for months about a possible run, but many things led to his decision, including his past investments in fossil fuels, which could hurt him among a Democratic Party turning away from oil. He will instead focus on impeachment, a representative for the Democratic financier said at the time. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.